With Vasita, you can control your entire billing lifecycle from a single platform and automate your payment follow-ups. Clients can easily pay their invoice online with PayPal or credit card. In this video, you'll learn how to create and send invoices and estimates. First, we'll need to configure some settings to control how your invoices and estimates will look and behave. Navigate to Settings, Payments, and switch to Invoices and Estimates tab. Enter your billing address. This will appear at the top of your invoices. Next, set up your terms and conditions for both invoices and estimates. These will appear at the bottom of the document. For invoices, you can specify a due date relative to the issuing date. Automated payment reminders will trigger based on the due date. So make sure to align it with your payment workflows. In this example, the invoice is due as soon as the client receives it. If you are using a credit card processor like Square or Stripe, you can accept partial payments. This allows your clients to pay their invoices in installments. Enable partial payments. Then, if desired, set the minimum percentage of the invoice amount that clients have to pay in each installment. Please note that partial payments can only be made on invoices. This setting does not apply to your services or online scheduling. Finally, we can set up some taxes or service fees. Type in the name of the tax and the tax rate. Click Add to add the tax to your service list. This tax we just created can be applied to a line item. It will increase the total invoice by 3% of the item's price when we apply it. Remember to click Save to save your changes when you're finished. Now let's create an invoice and send it to a client. In the Payments section of your account, select New, Invoice. Select the client from the list. Most of the standard invoice fields will already be filled out based on your settings, but you can edit them if required. Click on the drop-down to start adding line items. The menu includes all your services and products. Select the quantity, then click Add. Repeat and add as many items as you need. At this point, you can apply taxes and discounts. Click the More icon and select Edit. Apply discounts and taxes in the pop-up. Remember this, we set it up in the Invoices and Estimates settings. You'll notice that the total is now updated. Time for the finishing touches. You can add a note for your client in the Notes field. And CC additional recipients by selecting the Send to Additional Recipients option. Make sure to have your online payment checkboxes enabled so that your client can easily pay the invoice online. Once you hit Send, your invoice is on its way. Creating an estimate follows a very similar process. However, instead of paying the estimate, your clients will be required to approve or reject it. After the estimate is approved, you can convert it into an invoice for payment. We highly recommend customizing your invoice and estimate notifications and reminders. You can do that under Settings, Auto Client Messages, in the Payment section. By my estimation, you are now an expert with invoices and estimates. Keep watching to find out what Vesita can do for you. Visit our Help Center to learn more at support.vesita.com.